Ah. So I'm gonna make a thumbnail. I feel like doing a clickbait. And I have an idea, so we're gonna do it. Does that look believable for you guys? <laughs> I'm just gonna do a screenshot for you guys. Hello my Pandas viewers, welcome back to my channel. I am having a baby. <laughs> His name is Hushi and I got him from my friend's friend. And I was really really lucky to have him because their breed is actually rare to find. So yeah, I'm really lucky and he's my dream dog and oh my god, really really like I'm so happy to have him. So the next um, few clips that you're gonna see is just gonna be for like a week. That, that he's been with me until his two months which is gonna be his first vaccination but yeah I hope you guys um, enjoy this video <laughs> sorry for the clickbait <laughs> now day two and Tapehashi is now tired after playing he already took a wee and he also took a dump I'm just waiting for his pet blue so that is going to be the alternative for his pee pad are you tired? I'm gonna go sleep. It's tired. <laughs> okay. Go sleep. Good boy. He's still sleeping again. So um, I'm still waiting for his pet loop, which you're gonna see later because he's gonna come today. So I'm gonna save this. Usually I throw this away. But I need to save it so that I can try to put his scent, his pee on the pet loop so that he knows that this is like the pee pad that he's been peeing on. I heard the door. Okay, here we go. Nice, 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 nice. This is the pet loop. I got the large one so that it's convenient okay it's pretty big 
I had to pick the large one because like I said, he's gonna grow up. It's gonna be the same thing. So now I'm gonna get his pee and I have to try to rub it on the grass so that his scent is gonna be there and he's gonna be like, oh, this is where we're gonna pee. Because this is the same method that I did with the other dogs, which is Coco and Lulu. Let's see if it's gonna work for Hashi. Usually it works for dogs, so I don't really doubt it. <laughs> but I'm still kind of nervous and hoping that's gonna work out. And then I got a new pad and put it under so that it's like a double sign for him that okay this is where I go alright so I'm using my flash of my camera because I had to turn off the lights because I'm training him to sleep in the dark so uh, so this is the training guide of the pet Leo. it's pretty kind of straightforward but for me I had to make my own method which worked with um, Coco and Lulu earlier uh, before when I was training them so now I'm gonna use the same method that I used for Coco and Lulu for Hushi. So if my method doesn't work, I'm gonna use this method. We'll see what happens. Look at the baby. It's like this. And then one day it's gonna be like whoosh. <laughs> She he did the poop right there. I'm a proud mommy, my god. Or you deserve to go out. Up, up, up. Good boy. <laughs> so happy. Uh, it's you're still small. Let me help you. There you go. Good boy. <laughs> oh, you, you left your treat, baby. You left your treat. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Good boy. Okay, so it's now day three and it's kind of early for him to wake up because there's like a little his dry food left in his food bowl. So I give him half of a cup and he still ate. And then I saw him by himself that he did his dookie again, which is very, very good. And he also peed. So one thing that you guys should also keep in mind is that if you get your own pet glue, this the grass thing, if you're going to use this, this is the one that you put in the tray so it will absorb the pee and I have to put it because I have to keep his scent in there so that he knows that that's where he needs to be and not on the floor. You need to keep an eye on your dog if you're using this. So the grass is actually artificial so it's not real grass so that means you have to keep an eye on your dog because this one is made of plastic and they can digest this and i've seen reviews some review i think one review when an accident that their dog accidentally digested this so yeah that's one thing that you should consider keeping in mind 
and yeah um that's why whenever i see kashi trying to bite this off i immediately try to stop him over and over again because like i said he's still a puppy so yeah okay so if the tray is over here you're just gonna pull it not all the way but kind of like that and then you're going to pour the wee sponge because it's going to absorb the thing Good boy, that's a good boy. Go get the ball. Go get the ball. Good boy. What a good boy. <laughs> Give me the ball. Hashi. Get the ball. Go get the ball. Good boy. Tata good boy. <laughs> good boy.
sushi? No. Mm. No. Come. Come. I told you not to bite. I just told you not to bite. No. I told you not to bite. You bar? Hmm? Bar? Good boy. No. No biting. <laughs> Hashi, sit. Sit. Good boy. Ashi Sit Sit Go go Come Sit Sit Go 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 Who's a go go Who's a go go Sit Go go Come. Come here. Come. Go boy. That's a go boy. That's a go boy. That's a go boy. That's a go boy. Ashi, come. Come. Go boy. That's a go boy. Ashi, no, 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 no. It's my phone. Sit. Sit. Go boy. Come. Come. Go boy. Sit. Sit. Go boy. That's a go boy. Go boy. What's that, Hashi? Bro, I installed this thing to keep him out from the kitchen because whenever they cook stuff there's little bits of um, stuff that's going on the ground but then look at this ex escape artist bro <sighs> seriously don't look at me like that oh my goodness all right so i, I found like this extra blockage or whatever so i just put it there and we'll see what happens uh, my dad helped me install this one because this is actually short like uh, we need like four panels and it was up until there and so yeah we need four pa four panels but we couldn't find one so my dad just improvised and just um use the stoppers or whatever or the i don't know you call those to just like screw it up with the furniture that we have and he did the same thing here on the other end look at this dude he's like uh, hmm, just planning to like his next move his next evil plan to escape huh huh dude sit 
sit. Hashi, sit. So I just got home from the vet of Hashi. He, he just got his first shot of vaccination. I also requested microchip on him as well. So everything will be checked on the checklist. And I paid like around 130 something, which is not bad actually. I was, I was expecting to like pay, I don't know, 300 or something. But yeah, anyway, we are going back for three more vis visits every after three weeks i believe i don't know but yeah so i'm not gonna record that because it's pretty much the same thing so i'm just letting you guys know that you know um it's just gonna be for another three more visits in the vet and the vet is actually good and i really really recommend you guys uh, going there if you're near there the people there are also nice they're very helpful and yeah i'm really i really support the animal hospital so yeah i also actually asked them about if they um take in exotic pets they said that they do but it's a rare kind of situation because they only had two doctors there so yeah uh, so whenever something happens to shoyan i have to you know make a call i have to make a call and ask if the doctors are there or not if not, then I have to go a little more farther, like probably in Long, Long Beach or whatever, which sucks. But yeah, but yeah. Um, so yeah, that's that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry it took so long. I know it's this. I know it's almost um, October, and I haven't <laughs> I haven't um, uploaded like a video this month in September and. I've, I've just really been so busy and you know how huskies are they're very handful you need to give them full attention your full attention and it's really really i don't know it's a fun experience at the same time it's really uh, a lot but to take in but yeah it's really fun actually i have a lot of things to tell you guys i have a lot of you know um bad news and good news to tell you but i'm gonna talk about that in the next video and yeah um that's about it thank you so much for watching again don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel i'm new here and um it's a way for you guys to support me as well and at the same time you can dm me on my instagram account if you have questions about hamsters you can also follow me there if you want if you want i'm not forcing you anyway but yeah thank you guys so much i keep saying thank you but really thank you thank you so much and yeah that's about it that's what i've that's what i'm gonna tell you guys for now so yeah thank you so much for watching bye